welcome back to my daily mess and here we go back home okay six hours later And I am home. But the first thing I did was clean up a little bit. These two boxes were waiting for me when I got home. How nice with the second floor. I should definitely thank them. I know what's in them. Uh, but it is. Eight o'clock at night, and I have not eaten, and my sugar levels are low. I'm shaking. So let me eat first, then we'll do a box opening. All right, so I ate something, got some sleep, and in the morning, let's do this haul video. Okay. I know what I bought. So I know what's in here, but it's still good to get this little surprise when I get home. So, yep, I ordered paper. <laughs> and the why are Lego boxes so plain? Now, I really didn't think I was going to get this gift of purchase. I really was prepared to buy it off of somebody. Um, I'm really happy that I got it because it's something that I was looking forward to. So, this is something that um, not everybody got. But I used up my VIP points. And it was a tough decision. Because whatever I used my VIP points on is what I was going to get for a while. Because I'm not working at the moment. So this is a blanket. But it's going to be very useful in the Lego room. First of all, it is Lego. In other words, it's the brand name. Um, and I felt like part of the community, when everybody's wearing it, I can wear mine too. Because I felt a little left out. So, what else did we get? We got the VIP pack. Now, this one here has the fish. And helmet, some pineapple, some of these pieces that help you to have things move. In other words, these are gears. And some pigs. Some glow-in-the-dark heads. Those are awesome. So I did order before I left the glow-in-the-dark hair pieces to match them and these leaf elements are good these pink ovals some different colored frogs elbow macaroni What else did we get? In the box. Oh, yes. So this here is called Santa's Workshop. And I like the parts that are in it. It looks like that's a sticker uh, right there. 
and right there of the chest so you have blue skates you have pink controllers jars of different kinds and it does show different technique on how to put the roof on since I'm very bad at roofs paintbrush oh the little micro fig that's cool so it does look like um, a toy shop does. What does the front look like? Well, it doesn't show the front. Let me see. Well, it looks like a, like a gingerbread house. And now to the big box. I have a lot of unpacking to do, by the way. It's kind of all thrown around the house, all the bags and stuff. Now, how am I going to open this box? Like this. This is a different kind of box. It's different. I've never encountered encountered a Lego box like this. Hold on, guys. Okay, I figured it out. We cut the tape. Ooh. So here we are. This is the back of the box. This is set number 71741. It is massive. Now, for those of you who have been watching me for a while, knew that I wanted to use my VIP points on a different set. I was convinced. I was horn swoggled. I was told that I would get more enjoyment out of 5,685 pieces than I would out of a different set. Now this one has a large amount of minifigures as well. So all of those. Wow. Okay, and it even has the golden figure. All right, so that one there is a, uh, a figure that I thought I'd never get. Okay. I mean, it's called the Golden Woo. Now, I knew about it. I didn't remember the name, but I knew about it. And if you look real closely at the box, you can see that each box is like a different store or a different room and each person has their like own little habitat and it's all woven together into one city it's like a giant tree house giant tree house city and it looks pretty cool I've never seen a flying bike before. That's a cool way of doing the garden. So, I was planning on doing a Ninjago 
uh, themed city at one point. I do have a few different Ninjago sets. And this is definitely going to be the center of attention of that Ninjago city. Um, at the moment, uh, I am working on a different city and different layout, a different set. But this was definitely going to be built in the uh, somewhat near future. Um, February is Ninjago month. So I think we'll be building um, everything in February as far as Ninjago is concerned. Um, don't quote me on that. I'm just, because I'm not finished with the first city yet. Maybe February of next year. Who knows? Maybe I'll make a different month, Ninjago month. Or Ninjago city layout era. We'll do an era. So right now we're working on a new city era. Let's go check how it's coming out. Mm, yeah. I got bags everywhere. I finally emptied one, though. Hello, desk. Okay, this is the pick a -brick, um cup that I was working on. It was separating. So I have a lot of different pieces from a store visit. And that's before I went on my trip. Ooh, the boutique. Hotel. I still get the fun part of finishing that build. Awesome. Oh, first time I've laid eyes on my Lego room in two weeks. Hello, old friend. I remember building this. Wow, two weeks seems like a short time and a long time at the same time. Oh, there's my ocean. Okay, so I have an area over there for a build. Okay. So, so far I have only one building done. And here's my modular building city layout. Okay. I should actually move that mock. First of all, it's not finished. Oh, look at this. I spy with my little eye. Ah! <gasps> Oh, wait. I think what we should do is that new modular building that I'm making should go over here. Right? And this Ninjago sign should go up there. The Chinese restaurant should be part of Ninjago City. Does it look like it will go in the Ninjago's? Can this be nin Ninjago City Table? All right. I keep saying this. Don't quote me. Don't quote me. I was going to make this the mocking city. Where everything's a mock. Hmm. Everything's so changing in my life. Like... I can start a building and call it the pizza place and it turn into, I don't know, a toy store. Uh, I start a table and it's going to be this and it turns out to be that. Well, 
I don't know what I'll do, but I also have this bonsai tree to build. I took out. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Well, stay tuned to find out what I end up doing. Because need, need, I don't know even. So, stay tuned because I have a lot of good pieces. I still have another haul video to do. I'll probably do that for tomorrow. Of all the pab wall pieces that I got. Stay tuned to find out more. <laughs> okay. I, this is this is actually turned out pretty cool looking. I like it. 